It's the final day of the competition and Nick and Cleo's turn to host, but it seems expectations are low. I think Cleo and Nick, because they are a very young couple, they will struggle a bit to come up to my standards. I don't think they're going to be experienced. I do think they're super confident, think it's going to be very easy, and I think they're in for quite a surprise. Being the young couple, I think they might think that we don't know much about cooking, cooking and things of that nature, but I hope one day to rate myself as a Michelin star. Right now, I'm just breaking, I'm just breaking into that. I, th I think Michelin star status is coming soon, within, within the next six months. Mm. <laughs> yeah, one step at a time, eh? And the first step on the road to that star is chicken wings and sweet waffle. Sweet waffle might suit Sam. She does waffle on quite a bit after all. And I'm sweet. Not very appetising. There's not much chicken on a, on a chicken wing, is there? I think you'll find it's quality, not quantity. Well, chicken wings are the best because I have a secret ingredient imported all the way from America, so we're going to have a little bit of... You've got the American flavours. Got the flavours tonight. Got the flavours. Ooh, intriguing. For the chicken wing coating, Nick combines flour with breadcrumbs and garlic powder. Wish me luck. Good luck. And his secret ingredient. Right there, that's the one. That's the one. That's the one. You're all done under there. All right, then. Yeah. The wings will be coated and deep fried tonight and served with a waffle. I hope they make the waffle themselves, because that will be nice and will show that they've put some effort and some technical know-how. Oh, look, they've even wrapped them up. We've shot brought the waffles today because lazy. Fair dues. On to the main, Cajun salmon with prawn ceviche. I do like salmon, only if it's cooked properly and if it's hot. Uh, right. Like me. It's salmon again, but this one's done in Cajun spices, hallelujah. Love Cajun spices. That's just as well, cos Nick's sprinkling them all over. Mr Miami style. Mr Miami in the building. Bless him. The salmon's wrapped, ready for baking later, so it's on to the ceviche. Ceviche is raw fish, raw seafood that's cooked in citric juices, and it just tastes magnificent. So how come you're using ready-cooked prawns? Being as the guys yesterday had pre-cooked prawns and pre-peeled prawns, I went ahead and tried the same thing, so I'm just gonna... I got a free pass that way. Not sure that'll wash. In go ready-chopped garlic, seasoning, citrus juice, onions, peppers, tomatoes, and a glug of vinegar. They'll also serve with coleslaw and Nick's special black beans. Hood's next. Peach cobbler with creme anglaise. That sounds more of a school canteen type dessert to me. Even though I haven't got a clue what that is, I think I'll probably enjoy that. OK, then. Have you tried this before, Cleo? <laughs> See if you can get the peach up. Oh! Children! The remaining peaches are stewed with sugar, cinnamon and vanilla, popped into ramekins and topped with a crumble mix. Next, the creme anglaise. I think the creme anglaise is cream that's been glazed. You'd be wrong. It's French for posh custard. Nick beats egg yolks, vanilla, cinnamon and sugar, which is added to cream and milk. We'll leave that to set in a few minutes and then we'll warm it up when they get here. Right, you better get changed then, cos your guests are on the way. 